the madman! Oh, what a coincidence. Hello, Tornado Watch. You got to see my Chinese, my English. Here's the French. He's been playing French the whole time, I believe, right? Yes. One fish. I think it's really good to have your scout disrupting their dock build, so I'm going to hang the scout around here. Drop off the sheep real fast and come back. Like ships passing by in the dark. I expect my opponent to build a dock, but they don't always build a dock. I think on this map it's possibly fine to not build a dock, but I would think it's wrong. So since I think it's wrong to not build a dock, I'm gonna build a barracks. And then start fighting for his invisible dock. And if he's not building a dock, I'm going to imagine that he's trying to fight my dock. So the barracks also still makes sense. If he's not doing either of those, then I just expanded in two minutes of the game. And that's also good. Okay, the opponent is choosing to counter with an... Oh, those are spearmen. Yep, as expected. My job is to distract. If I fight him evenly, that's really good for me. 
Because I have the dock fighting. I think I have won because I am uh, a fish man. If we both burn our resources into a uh, building spearmen, the person who is also fishing will come out ahead. That's why they call me Aquaman. So he's decided to copy pasta my strategy, but he's a little bit late to the party. when I get build order wins. That's a build order win right there. A build order win means your strategy was good. It was so good that the tactics didn't necessarily matter. My theory was sound. Everything went right. True. Bow down, mortal. <laughs> he said it well. He who controls the fish controls the universe. It's because of that that I've tried so many different sieves. I tried Delhi just because I wanted to, uh, control the fish in the river better. I was like, ah, we'll just do French. 